Dave here. Uh, today we're going to go ahead and discuss the Kosodachi stance. I'm always looking online, I'm always looking up references, but I can never really find good examples on how to use this stance. Uh, I found out how to use it by exploring other styles, say judo or other forms of karate. And what I've discovered was some, uh, some pretty interesting ways to use it. I want to be able to share those ways. Uh, I'm going to do like a three or four part segment on how you can use these stances. I don't want to make one big long half hour video explaining the different ways you can do it. So I'm going to break it up into uh, several videos so I can give you a thorough example on each and every way of how to use the stance. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, here we go. All right. In this example of Kosadachi, I'm going to use this as a throw. You see it in the katas. You see uh, in this kata here where you assume this position and you pop up in here and you jump and you do one of these, another Kosadachi. I'm going to go over the first one, uh, the first move here, where you assume this stance, or this Kosadachi stance in this scenario. And this is what it's going to look like. You see this a lot in judo. You see a lot of guys train this in judo. And what they do is they slow it down step by step. First you grab, you step in, you turn, look, as you're lowering your center of gravity, hoist up the individual, and then throw them. This is what it would look like. So you have the kata here, then pops up, and then throw. So in training, in judo, they call this fit in. But this is what it looks like. You just step in, and here, this is it. This is what you do, over and over, fit in. But when you're throwing somebody, you can grab anywhere. You can grab here, here, it doesn't matter. Wherever you can get a piece of fabric. And then just like the, just like the kata, here, you grab, pull, assume this close to the chain, lower your weight, lift, throw. When you're teaching this, you want to do step by step, but in reality, it's extremely fast. You almost don't even see the step occurring. You hardly ever see the current. So it's quick. As you can see, it comes in and out. So that's that. Uh, that's that version of Kosa. Or that's how you would use Kosadachi in this example. So it's cool. You get right in the throat, and that's it for this segment. Thank you for watching.